Hi guys, welcome to this session. In today's session, we're going to see how to create a lead gen ad campaign inside the LinkedIn ads account. So in order to create this campaign, guys, we can start getting into the account itself. And from here, we can start building a new campaign altogether. So first you select the campaign group in which you want to create the new campaign. And then we start building a new campaign from this particular space. So when you start creating a campaign, uh, the first thing LinkedIn will ask you is to choose the campaign objective. Now, the objective over here is that we want to do lead generation. So we're going to choose lead generation from here. And now we can start filling up all the other details. Let's give it a name as well for this campaign. So first, what we can do is we can go ahead and create some new audience for this. So location targeting we can set over here. In this manner, you can select some locations. Then we can go ahead and choose the target audience, what kind of audience we want to target over here. So we can choose some demographics. Okay, so age, gender, all those things which we can select from here, member age and member gender. Apart from that, if you want, you can also go ahead and add some other audiences like job functions, job titles, which we can target from here as well. Okay, so let's say we're looking for people from job functions related to IT. Or engineering. Okay, so we can choose that as well in this manner. Once you select this, now we are coming to the ad format where we can create this specific ad. Okay, so you can go ahead and choose single image ad for this. We have to provide the other details as well, like the budget for the campaign. Okay, what will be the budget and when will the campaign start? So we can give a start date, end date over here as well. Okay, so here you can specify the end date. And then you also specify the bidding strategy for this campaign. Now, the idea is that we want to have leads generated, which will possibly mean that people clicking on our ad and filling up the form. Okay, so we can choose maximize delivery, which will really help to achieve that main objective. Then we can also use the conversion tracking, which we have created for lead gen out here. Once you provide all this information, we can go to the next page where we are going to go ahead and build out the ad. So here, as you can see, we're in the ad section, we can create new ads. So the first thing which you do over here is you can go ahead and start giving name this ad in this particular manner. We can also give an introductory text for this ad. We can give the landing page of our website, okay, which we want <coughs> out here. Since it's a image ad, so we will have to upload an image which we can provide as well in this manner. Once you provide the image, we can also go ahead and give the headline for this and provide a description. So this becomes the ad part of it. Now under the ad, what we are going to do is we are going to provide the form details. So for which we can now go to the form details, the second part, and start creating the form. The first thing which is required over here is a call to action. What exactly do you want your customers, your members to do on the form? So let's say we're looking for quotation. They can ask for a quotation and we can create a new form altogether. So here we can start building out the form.
Okay, we can give an offer headline, which is like a headline for the form, which we can provide and give some other details as well. In this manner, we will also have to provide the privacy policy URL for which you can go to your website and go to the privacy policy page and take the URL from there and put it out here. So for example, I'm going to my website. Now, usually the privacy policy page will be at the bottom of the page. So like here, you can see under navigation, we can come to privacy policy. And this URL we can provide now on the in this particular section. Apart from this, if you want to provide any text related to privacy policy, which you can provide out here. Once these information is filled in, <clears throat> we can move to the next part, which is lead generation, where the information which you're collecting. So you can collect some basic information from here, okay, like phone number, city as well. Apart from that, you have options to choose other options which you want to collect. You can choose from here and you can add those in the form. <clears throat> Once you provide this, guys, then we are coming to the confirmation page. This is the page which will show up to the user once they fill up the form. Okay, in this manner, you can provide the response part as well and you can give the landing page so the landing page can be your home page where you want people to come in so again you can provide your business home page out here and you can keep the thank you message call to action to be your website company website url so these are all the details which you will fill in over here and then you can see a preview how the information page is going to look like on desktop and on mobile as well it will appear out here okay and then we can go ahead and create this ad so now you can see this is how the ad gets created out here with the form and we can now move to the last page where we can check the campaign once before launching you can go through all the details okay if you want to make any changes you can do that and then we can launch the campaign once you launch the campaign, this will go under review. LinkedIn will take like 24 to 48 hours to check your ads. And once it is approved by them, then the campaign can go live. In this manner, guys, we will be able to create a LinkedIn lead generation ad campaign inside the account. I hope this makes sense and everybody understands now how to build this campaign out. Thank you so much, guys, for listening into this session today. Have a great day, guys.